guys, what is up? Welcome back to the Daily Dose. Guys, it's currently Thursday today. Um, I have been at work all day. I came home and I completely crashed out. Um, I think today's been one of the worst days for me with this illness or whatever I've got. Um, I was just drained of energy throughout the whole day. I was trying to like give myself some caffeine, food, stuff, but was already working and as soon as I got home I crashed out. So I'm starting the vlog today at quarter to nine in the PM. So yeah, it's been a it's been a bit of a hard day for me today. But that's no excuse. I'm still gonna upload this. I'm still recording this. Um, I still managed to do a few bars at work as well. Uh, and like I said yesterday, with the music it is going amazingly. I would not ask for anything better. This is why I don't mind have I mind starting music at a later date. Like the things I'm coming out with now, I've, I'm like, as a person, I'm growing every single day. And if I had got to stardom or all that sort of stuff when I was 18, 19, I'd be that guy making them club bangers with no uh, meaning behind the music. But because I'm a 25 year old man who's been through some stuff um, and, you know, I've seen the system, how it works, I've been through the education system, I've done all these things, these are helping me with my music. And one thing I've been telling the students this week is there's no there's no age limit or expiry date on greatness. If you want to be great, if you want to do all these amazing things, you can still do it. Whether you're 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, whatever. One example I always use um, is Ricky Gervais. Obviously, um, if you guys know Ricky Gervais, great over the office and all that uh, good stuff. He was, I believe, um, like maybe mid 30s to late 30s when he first got like stardom and stuff and really got on the map and now he pretty much hosts the Emmys nearly every single year you know he created The Office man one of my favorite shows I I'm filled with genuine joy when I watch The Office um, and it's the UK version and the American version so you know he's done a lot of amazing things and he was you know past his prime so you know, there's no excuse not to do stuff. And like me being ill, was no excuse not to make videos. I'm going to keep making videos. I did music today. I did all these different things. So I'm going to keep doing, keep keep going, keep doing my thing. Uh, and see how that goes. Also, guys, this weekend, as I mentioned about the gaming channel uh, yesterday, this weekend, uh, we're going to be recording something. We're going to try and get a hold of capture cards. We're going to get one each so we can capture all the game footage and stuff. And then maybe record ourselves over it. Um, or maybe do an audio. I might do the video thing because I've got the camera and stuff and hopefully the guys can get some equipment If not then they can use this when I'm not using it to record uh, which is no problem uh, But yeah, we're gonna really get this gaming channel ch channel gaming channel off the ground now, so We're gonna start recording various games. We've got mafia that comes out on the 7th um, And you got FIFA as well. I haven't got my copy of FIFA yet. But it's all good. I'm not salty about that. It's all good um, That's just giving me more free time to write and all all that good stuff so I'm not too fussed about that um, and guys I was watching Casey Neistat's video today um, and he was talking about how to make a video go viral um, and how that sort of like you know trajected his channel to success and how he did that so what I'm gonna try and aim for he said making a viral video is completely accident um, you just make a video and and just see how people respond to it I'm never gonna make one of them outrageous videos where you do this and do that and you know it's fake like I want a genuine viral video um, so in the next four to six weeks I'm gonna be creating different content like I said I've got movie the movie review Monday that's not I don't think any of that will ever go viral uh, so I'm not really focusing on that but there's gonna be other things in the works in the mix that I'm gonna try and hopefully aim for that viral feel of people come to my channel and stuff because like I said most people on YouTube Honest to God, I can wholeheartedly say the reason I want people to come to my channel is because the content I'm going to be releasing or the content that I do release, my music and all that stuff, I want to inspire people around me. And I want them to, even for 10 minutes in the mornings, like when I get to a point, probably like, I don't know, a thousand, maybe two thousand, maybe a hundred thousand subscribers, I'm going to start releasing content, hopefully motivating people. But I feel right now there's no point doing that because there isn't enough of an audience. I do do little segments and stuff, like I'm doing it right now, like without the Ricky Gervais thing. Yeah, hopefully that, you know, sparks off something in, in a person. But I want to get onto a level where I'm motivating people on a daily basis. I'm motivating, you know all these like Tony Robbins I think his name is like the motivational guy or whatever at the end of the day you don't really need someone telling you every single day to do something because hopefully after like the first time you hear someone do something or 
they became someone then you are motivated instantly but this channel is for everyone so someone might come to this channel be motivated and they may recommend me to a friend so I'm there for their friend too so that's what I want to do with my music with YouTube even with gaming man like people love gaming but they don't realize that they can make money off of it they can be successful from it and you know they don't do that but guys I'm rambling now so I'm gonna stop right there um, so guys this is the segment today if you guys enjoyed this vlog, give it a thumbs up, hit that like button, share and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys tomorrow for another vlog. Peace and love.